week marks 21 years since a father and son terrorized Waukesha County, killing a police captain. Mike Jacobs was the only reporter to sit down with them in prison. And tonight, Katie Crowther brings us the story behind the story. Katie. Carol James and Ted Oswald were two of the state's most despised criminals. Mike gave us a glimpse into their chilling minds. April 28th, 1994. James and Ted Oswald robbed a bank in Wales and led police on a chase. When Waukesha Captain James Lutz caught up to them, the Oswalds jumped out of their car and opened fire. He never had a chance to react. Mike Jacobs got exclusive jailhouse interviews with both of them. So are you cold, heartless killers? Probably not. Probably not? <laughs> I'm being a little facetious here. What do you mean by a cold? Have you ever talked to a cold, heartless killer? Am I talking to one now? I wasn't afraid of him, even though there were no guards present. But he was the personification of evil. During his trial, Oswald winked at Mrs. Lutz one day and blew her a kiss on another. That was a cruel thing to do. Well, remind me of that. Let's see. <laughs> even after the fact, how cold and calculating and casual. Those same words describe the abusive way James treated his son, Ted, who he trained to be a criminal. His dad made him watch while he killed newborn puppies. Smack their head, you know, with, uh, when they're very young. I think I started crying and uh, he started laughing. And then he said something that made me wonder if somehow James Oswald was still in control. I, to I failed my father. How did you fail him? He's in prison for the rest of his life. And so am I. And the fact that two of them ended up in prison, separate prisons for life, it's where they belong. And Mike, you say you always like either interviewing heroes or villains. Yeah. Well, the Oswalds are villains. They fall into the latter category. And it also is a chilling reminder, honestly, of the dangers that police officers face every day when they go to work. Because they never know when somebody's going to jump out and open fire, which is what happened in this case. You're right. A frightening mentality. Awful case. Mm -mm. Thanks, Thanks guys. Well,